the deal. What up, party people? I'd like to welcome you to another episode of Hip Hop Raise Me the Block.com, where we celebrate 48 years of the youngest genre in your music. I'm talking about hip hop, y'all, where it's about the knowledge, the culture, and the lifestyle. Hip Hop Raise Me. Now today's episode, we taking it to Brownsville, Brooklyn, where artists emerged by the name of Master Ace with his debut album, which dropped on this date more than 32 years ago. Now take a look around, it's the debut solo studio album by American rapper Master Ace. It was released on July 24th, 1990 through Cold Chilling Records with distribution via Reprise Records. Recording sessions took place at House of Hits in Chestnut Ridge, New York, and at Libra Digital Sound in Long Island City. Production was handled by Marley Marl and Mr. C. Now, after appearing on the classic hip-hop cool cut, The Symphony, with the Jewish crew in 1988. Just like a shot from a cannon, I am the man in charge, and I'm the planet. I am strong enough that it can lift your soul. I'm the originator, and my rhymes are made of gold. His first single, Together, Back with Letter to the Better in 1989. Together was included in an album as well as remixed version of Letter to the Better. Released in June, nine, June 1990, Me and the Biz. Seven on the corner, calling cuties on reportable. Me and Master Aces. Get it. Word to Miz. Now who was an ace? Me and the Biz. Uh, hey. I got to. Peaked at number 47 on a hot R&B and hip hop song and number 8 on a hot rap songs. The song, a tribute of sorts to label mate Biz Marquis in which Ace plays the role of both himself and Biz who reportedly couldn't make it to the studio for the actual collaboration he desired was later featured on Grand Theft Auto San Andreas as song in rotation on the fictional radio station Playback FM. A single for I Got to was released only in Europe and UK. Reaching the peak position of number 13 on the hot rap songs, the album's third single, Music Man, back with Aces as Wild, well, remained on the chart for a total of nine weeks. Now moving on, back with Where I Cindy was released on March 6, 1991 as the final single from the Take a Look Around. Where do you rate this debut album from Master Ace and History of Hip Hop? Was it a classic or was it wick, 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 whack? Now drop it in the comments. And before you go, hit the like and the subscribe button. My name is CEO Dream and this is Hip Hop Raising Me to Blog.com. To begin, once again, my friend.